A heavy rain combined with a broken storm water pipe caused big damage in a St. Bernard neighborhood. Now the cleanup has begun, and Nine on Your Side reporter Bryce Onslinger is live with what things are looking like right now. Bryce? Yeah, Carol, that, uh, that rain Steve mentioned, not good news for people living here. You can see the water has receded at this point, but the, the pile of belongings that uh, were ruined by rounds of flooding starts to grow as people here assess the damage after two rounds of flooding. Industrial strength wet vacs and dryers are in place as crews from ServPro work to dry out four homes on Bank Avenue in St. Bernard just off I-75. We're just trying to get it dry and get these people back to a livable state. The Surf Pro crews were called after neighbors say a stormwater pipe broke due to the construction of a wall along the highway. That sent water down into the street early this morning and then again this afternoon. The drains backed up again. We had about 18 inches of water come back in. The ruined items line the street, ready to be picked up by trash collectors. You can see everything from video game equipment to furniture and the basement sink are being disposed of. Police car in the middle of the street and there was one truck over here getting the pump started and stuff and I think they couldn't get it done. And uh, I just seen a whole bunch of lights down the street. It was crazy. Daniel King is lucky. His home suffered far less damage than his neighbors down the street. We got a little wet, but not that much wet like they did. So kind of feel sorry for them. All their stuff got messed up. They had to pull up all the carpet and stuff. Now these homeowners can only hope this large pump is effective so that they don't endure a third round of flooding when more rain starts to fall. And that's right, it could be a sleepless night for many folks on this, uh, on this stretch of road as they worry about that more, uh, another stretch of rain like Steve was talking about, but hopefully uh, that doesn't happen and all the pumps take care of the water that could run down here on the road. Bryce Onslinger, not on your side, live in St. Bernard.